ici. There's a man here. Il y a un homme ici. You have a pain. Tu as une douleur. On one side of your stomach here. Sur un côté de ton ventre. You don't know what is happening to you. Tu ne sais pas ce qui t'arrive. It's paining you. Ça te fait mal. All the time. Tout le temps. Go to hospital. Allez à l'hôpital. You are always sitting down. Do this. You are not. Va à l'hôpital. Tu es seulement sur place. You don't know what is happening. Tu ne sais pas ce qui yeah. t'arrive. Yeah. Ici. Have you gone to the hospital? Est-ce que tu es parti à l'hôpital? Go there. You are always sitting down. Go buy drugs. You're sitting down. Achetez les médicaments. Vous êtes seulement assis. Yeah. Ici. It's human of God. Huh? It's true. It's for how long? Ça fait combien de temps? One month now. That is kidney problem coming up. Ça te donne un problème rénal. You are developing kidney problem. Vous êtes en train de développer l'insuffisance rénale. You are getting tired very fast. Et voilà It's pourquoi vous fatiguez God. rapidement. Are your parents here? Est-ce que vos parents no, sont ici? Because they are already complaining in the house. Et ils se plaignent déjà à la maison. That you are getting lazy. Que tu deviens It's paresseux. Hein? Ils sont. Put your hand there. Uh, How is it affecting you? I just, I just at one moment I just discovered that I was unable to study. My performance in school is reducing and laziness just started. Laziness to, started? Yes. Even to pray, I'm unable to pray. Even to read my Bible, I'm unable to do anything. Even when I go, because I teach, when I go to teach, even I'm unable to teach. I'll just sit, feel, and start sleeping. After this prayer, yeah. After this prayer, après cette prière, you will be leaving Cameroon. Tu vas Amen. quitter le Cameroon. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. One, two, three. Be free. Now, go, go, Jesus' name. Clap for Jesus Christ. Thank you. Get up. That's all. You will never get it again. Vous n'allez plus jamais ressentir cela. Thank you, Jesus. And uh, this spirit of masturbation. Et cet esprit de masturbation. You should avoid it totally. Il faut éviter cela totalement. Yeah. Yes, my Lord. Yes, you go far. Vous allez aller loin. Thank you, Jesus. Celebrate, Thank Master you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Good morning, brother. Please tell us your name and where you come from. Good morning. My name is my name is Ahuke Ding Great Brian. I come from Northwest, but I live here in Yaounde. Please share with us your testimony. Okay. Last week Sunday I came to church and the man of God gave a general prophecy that there is a man seated somewhere buried and he's feeling pains at his right side of his stomach. So I stood up, I came in front. There's a man here. He said, yeah, no. You have been feeling pains at the right side of your stomach and you don't know what is happening. You have been taking drugs and he comes he comes down but he's still there. So I confirm the prophecy to be true because for one month now I have always been feeling pains inside of my stomach and at the right side. So when I feel the, I feel the pains, I go to a local pharmacy, I buy drugs. When I take the drugs, it calms down. But after some few hours, it, the pains the pains come back. So I did not know what was happening and I didn't go to the hospital for checkup. So when he said that prophecy, I really confirmed the prophecy to be true 100%. And when I came in front, he gave, uh, he prayed for me and said, I will it's no longer feel long. the pain. That let me go for a checkup. So I went to the hospital for a checkup with my sister. When we went to the hospital, the doctor said, the you are getting tired very fast. Et voilà pourquoi vous vous fatiguez rapidement. Are your parents here? Est-ce que vos parents sont ici? Because they are already complaining in the house. Et ils se plaignent déjà à la maison. That you are getting lazy. Que tu deviens pas le seul. When we carry out the test, my sisters, my mother were afraid. How is it affecting you? I just, at one moment, I just discovered that I was unable to study. My performance in school is reducing and lazy. Man, inside of me, when they to pain in our life, the man of God is able to pray. Even to heal my baby, I'm So no need for me to be afraid. I am healed indeed. So when we carried out the test, it took two hours. The results came out. 
The test for hepatitis B and C came out negative. Can you clap mightily for Master Jesus? So, brother, before going to the hospital, were you still experiencing this pain? Immediately after the man of God prayed for me, that same moment in church, I did no longer feel the pain. Right. Never Clap again. mightily for Master Jesus. Painkillers stop the pain for us, but the power of God stopped the pain permanently and instantly. You are in the presence of God where that same power is available. If you want to connect to this level of healing, just clap louder for the master healer in Jesus' name. So we can see some reports on the board beside you. Are those the reports from the tests you carried out in the hospital? Yeah, exactly. Because after the test for hepatitis B and C, the doctor said we have to confirm that there is nothing wrong with your kidney or any part of your body. Then he sent me to go and do an echography, abdominal echography, to prove that there is nothing wrong with my kidney. So when I went to carry out the test, it shows here that the visual source here that all my internal organs are okay plus my kidney. There's no problem with it. These are the results here. My kidney, my lungs, my bias, everything are okay. That is no longer any sickness in me. When the Son of Man heals, you are healed indeed. Even abdominal echography attests to that. Can you clap mightily for Master Jesus this morning? So, brother, with what God has done for you, what would be your word of advice to those watching you this moment? My word of advice to everyone watching me right now and out of here. No matter the situation you go through, don't be afraid. Just trust in God. We have a church in Cameroon, Capernaum Church. Trust the man of God and you shall be healed in Jesus' name. Amen. And the word of advice from our spiritual father to you this morning is that as you are healed, go back and make the word of God a standard for your life. And better is not good enough. The best is yet to come in Jesus' name. Dimanche dernier, alors qu'il était dans la présence de Dieu, le serviteur de Dieu a donné une prophétie générale selon laquelle il y avait un homme ici qui ressentait une douleur au niveau de son ventre, au côté gauche de son ventre. Se sentant concernant, il est sorti et aujourd'hui il confirme la prophétie comme étant vraie. Et non, ici, si, pendant un mois, pain. il expérimentait Je... la douleur au niveau du côté gauche de son ventre et dit que cette douleur était récidive dans la mesure où l'homme qui prenait des médicaments, ça calmait, mais plus tard, le mal revenait. L'homme de Dieu lui a dit par la suite que ta famille se plaint, que tu, te, tu, tu es paresseux et cette paresse est due à ce mal. Il a prié pour lui au nom Alors, de Jésus-Christ, tout en lui rassurant que la douleur a disparu. Le frère Brian nous dit que instantanément, cette douleur qui a perduré pendant un mois a totalement disparu et l'homme de Dieu lui a recommandé de retourner à l'hôpital. Lorsqu'il est allé à l'hôpital, sa famille était apeurée que si les résultats révèlent que tu as l'insuffisance rénale, où allons-nous prendre de l'argent pour pouvoir prendre soin de toi Mais lui, avec la foi, tout en se basant sur ce que l'homme de Dieu a dit, il dit, il a dit que tout ira bien pour lui. Lorsqu'il a fait des examens, on lui a demandé de faire tout d'abord l'examen de l'hépatite B et de l'hépatite C qui se sont avérées négatives. Et par la suite, il a fait une échographie abdominale qui a attesté que l'intérieur, la partie interne de Brian était normale. Alors c'est pour dire que ce mal a été éradiqué, le Seigneur Jésus l'a libéré et le conseil qui nous véhicule ce matin c'est de faire confiance en Jésus Christ. Nous avons une église, l'église Capénaum de toutes les nations, fait confiance au serviteur de Dieu et tout ira bien pour nous. Est-ce qu'on peut acclamer très fort le Seigneur Jésus Christ? Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like and share. God bless you. Merci d'avoir regardé, abonnez-vous, aimez et partagez. Que Dieu vous bénisse.